G'day guys, this is Will from All Played Fishing. Uh, this is the video of the uh, Bass Electric uh, lock stock round that was held on uh, Sunday just gone. And um, I just wanted to run through how we went and what lures and techniques we used to get our fish. To start off with, it was a very uh, chilly morning. Uh, I think it was below 10 degrees. The water temp was 17. So we thought straight away, um, it's gonna be a jerk bait bite on the edge in the weed. Uh, we know a spot towards the back of the dam. We've fished very well on double clutches before. Um, so yeah, we headed there straight away. And um, Nathan caught his fish very quickly on a lure that um, was very successful on the day, which is the, um, the Duo International Realis uh, 63 SP. So a little bit fatter profile than um, some of the other jerk baits we've used in the past. But yeah, just a really cool looking lure, really realistic. Uh, raised gill plates, 3D holographical eyes, um, and just a real natural colour. The ghost minnow we chose, so uh, probably the only downfall with it is the hooks, the trebles. Yeah, definitely an upgrade on that. Uh, we only didn't change prior because we didn't want to, we were worried if it was going to ruin the, um, the swim or the presentation of the lure, so <coughs> we just left it. But yeah, next time I'll we'll definitely change it. Um, I'd probably go at size 12 in the BKK hooks, in the trebles, so yeah, probably an upgrade on them. Would, might, would definitely help, and I think it would allow the lure to just sit and not float or sink, because this one slowly floats, and with a suspending lure, they're not really meant to um, float, but we, we found it was very slow, which um, I personally didn't like, but yeah, I think with an upgrade of the trebles, um, yeah, it would definitely um, it would definitely work, and um, it would sit right. So, yeah, he caught his fish very early, Nathan, um, and his bag of 2.3 kilos was his first two, and it actually won in the comp. So, uh, congratulations again, Nate. Um, and then my fish came a little bit later than his. Um, I caught my first two on the Duo Lure. And then it was about between, I think, 11 and 12 o'clock where I got my, my uh, two next upgrades. And that came on the, um, on the dialer double clutch. Uh, I've had success in the past in this lure, so I, I stuck with it. Uh, it dives a little bit deeper than the, um, the Duo. Uh, I think the Duo only dives about 0.6 to a metre or something like that, maybe 0.8. Uh, that would have worked really well in like the low light period. But when the sun came up and beamed them, the double clutch, this is the 75mm Ghost Whacker Saggy, which is my favourite colour, the lock stock, um, hands down. It dives a little bit deeper, so when I was flipping along the weed, I knew a spot towards um, in the southern arm that I would probably get a couple more fish, and then I got an upgrade, so I was very happy about that. So I'll double clutch. I've got a video on that, uh, I might put it up here in the, su in the suggested video, um, about two years ago in April, so same time this year. And that uh, absolutely drained the bass then. So that got me into third place of a bag of 1.67 kilos. So I was pretty happy with that. Yeah, so I'm gonna go up and um, do the Clary Hall Dam um, comp now, which is held on the 16th of May. So I'm really looking forward to that. I'd love to see as much guys from New South Wales go up. Um, I'm driving seven hours away um, get to go up there, so. Look, they're a great bunch of guys that do it. Um, Matt, who ran the comp, um, did a great job. Um, really good bloke. And um, yeah, it just makes you want to go back, you know? Really good people. And yeah, a good comp, you know? So anyone can do it. I did it in my kayak. Uh, I had a 60 litre live well esky on the back with like 60 or maybe 50 litres of water, so 50 kilos, so I managed, but um, it was a bit unsteady every now and then, but yeah, I got through it. So yeah, anyway, I hope, um, I hope you enjoy the video guys and I hope to see a few views up there for Clary Hall. Yeah. Right, one o'clock everybody, let's go.
What are you using? What are you getting them on? Nay. What are you using, Nay? Nay. Hey, Nay. What are you getting them on? What are you using? What are you using? Are you using chatterbait? What are you using? Nay? What are you using? Oh, really? How, how big? How big are they? Oh, really? What? 47? <laughs> oh, mate, that's, that's a good fish. Oh, you'd be stoked. I'm seeing a lot of good fish on the sounder in the weed here, eh? Oh, I'm stoked for you, eh? I said I'm stoked for you. Yeah, you're um, you're sitting pretty comfy, I reckon, at the moment. Yeah, I just had a good feeling about up here, eh? Yeah. Because we know we know there's big fish in this area. Yeah. Yeah, 17 degrees. I've got. Why? The little fish won't bite up here. Yep. Too cold. Yep. I think if there's any fish up here, they're going to be legal. Ooh, that's a hit. I got a hit, knife. I got one hit before too. Yeah. It, it like pushed it forward. Oh, right. And I thought he had it and I was winding up the slack and he didn't have it. So I think he's just pushed it forward. I really need to get a bag soon. Oh, I, you'll get a bag. You'll catch them somehow. Been in, within 20 metres. That's crazy. Oh. Well, what a way to ruin a spot. Yep. I'm on. Yeah. Right. Nah. He's, he's legal, though. Oh, I'd be high 30s. He'll do, though. Yeah, he'll do. Maybe 37. Oh, it's about time. God. <laughs> that was a really weird bite too.
Oh my god, my yak is gonna tip. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> that is not good. Just as a bay up the back there, just before we get up towards the river, and uh, yeah, the, the key today I found was jerk baits, um, just shallow diving jerk baits, and yeah, got my two fish real early, uh, probably in the first half an hour from fishing, so got a little bit tougher from there, but um, yeah, just persisted with jerk baits, and um, that got nearly all my fish today, so, so it's two just good that, ones fairly early. Just that on. shallow standing weed, yeah. throwing them in between, yeah. ripping them back through the weed, and yeah. I'm grabbing it. Yep, no, that's what they were doing on the paws. About one or two second paws, so yep. they weren't, yep. uh, didn't have to have a long pause today, so. Yep. And they were smacking it. Mm. Very right. cool. Yep. A good technique. Yeah. <laughs> All right, mate, well done. Cheers. Come on, you know.